Hey everyone, I'm about to take you through what it is like to be a day in the life of a delivery driver. I do both Grubhub as well as Domino's. So we're gonna go through a day of what this is like, both Grubhub and Domino's, starting off with Grubhub today, and uh, see what kind of mischief we can get to and also what kind of money we can make. At the end of the night, we'll sum it up and uh, see how this day went. So we need to get started because, you know, early bird gets to warm and all that. <laughs> or early bird gets to money at least. So we're going to get started and uh, let's see what kind of day we can uh, make out here today. So let's get started. Well, first off, we need to make sure we get our delivery bags here. Uh, usually store them in this car right here, my other car. Gonna put them into my delivery car. Oh, in the back seat. All right. Uh, let me put a little better than that. Uh, all right. Bags in place. Now comes the fun part: the waiting game. Yeah, unfortunately, waiting for that first order, well, is just that. Waiting for that first order. <sighs> Usually, um, during this kind of period, I do throw the things around the house while I'm waiting. Um, and it's, you just got to wait until that first order, unfortunately. So, we're going to sit here and um, enjoy the relaxation period that I'm going to get for right now. So, because I might not get that later on. And uh, hopefully we can get this day started. Alright, here we go. Well, so ever since that first delivery, it's been pretty busy. Um, got five deliveries so far, 
and I think I'm almost at 40 if not at 40 yeah I'm just oh I'm knocking on the door of 40 right now and it's only 256 I'm gonna be doing this for another two hours Grubhub wise and then we're gonna be moving along to Domino's and uh, we'll get a lot more orders there but the money of course um, will be a lot different <laughs> a lot less um, Grubhub does their pays payment a lot different than Domino's even though I do I mean obviously with Domino's I get my hourly pay as well as um, my tips so but I won't be including that in the actual calculations um, that our the time that I spent on deliveries on Grubhub is sort of calculated in so that's what makes the difference but doing good so far <laughs> hopefully we're gonna make it at least uh, to 60 or 70 today but we'll see still got a long ways to go with my grub hubbing for today ended up this close to making it to seventy dollars uh, 69 and some change so with the cash tip so not too bad not too bad uh, could have been better but I've had better days but still not terrible uh, decided to go ahead and stop off and get my dinner while I'm out <laughs> deliver my own food after all um, about to head home uh, eat that Get prepared for Domino's and then we'll continue this day on the day of the life of a delivery driver. Now it's time for a part two here tonight. Got my Domino's uniform on and my hat on and all that good stuff. Ready to make some deliveries tonight. We'll be working until two o'clock in the morning. So yeah, kind of schedule I have pretty much I do like 11 to 4 for Grubhub mainly, and uh, even though I went over by an hour today, and uh, 
7 until either 1 or 2 o'clock, depending on the day. Uh, the calculations from this point on will be a little bit different. Uh, the ones I calculated, obviously, from Grubhub included tip, uh, time, and mileage. So it kind of included everything. And that's how they calculate, you know, how they pay us at Grubhub. But uh, Domino's, I'm going to be doing tips in the beginning. I'll, I'll have the mileage calculations but later on tonight as well as my roundabout hourly rate because I usually don't know exactly when I clock out so I can't be precise on it. But this will give you an idea at least what I'm making um, on a regular basis doing this pretty much Wednesday through Sunday so oh, man it's gonna be a wet one though tonight which it wasn't going to be uh, I prefer nice and lovely nights um, but you do make more money when it rains usually so at least that's good and I've been doing pretty good this uh, past week so I'm expecting to do pretty good tonight especially considering it's a Saturday so that should add to the fun. Anyways, uh, let's get on with part two and make more, even more money here. to stop to get some gas uh, was running low there <laughs> trying to find that last address uh, bad thing about those dark streets it's hard to find at least uh, lady was nice and the tip was good so <laughs> always a good thing we're doing pretty good so far uh, we're at $22 in tips I like to be at least about $25 uh, on tips by the end of the night so it's only almost nine o'clock and I'm already there so that's that's always a good sign see the reason I uh, set myself up though for 25 bucks because usually with a mileage I end up with about 50 which is what I try to aim for every night anymore always good <laughs> so we're just gonna continue on delivering and uh, make that money and uh, see what we can come up with by the end of the night Whew, got a long ways to go
o'clock now and um, only uh, three more hours of delivering to go. Uh, just a second ago, got the uh, infamous $10 tip. Uh, so that was always a good thing. It's rare to see those, uh, especially, at least for delivering pizzas anyways. So it's good to see one. Uh, and it came from the local hospital here. So <sighs> always helpful. So right now I'm looking at $46 in tips. So I'm more than likely looking around 60 something dollars right now, just right now. Uh, so we still got three hours to go. So we're going to see what else we can get. But uh, yeah, this night's moving right along. It's been pretty steady. I wouldn't call it busy, but definitely steady. So <sighs> just the way I like it. <laughs> if it could stay like this all the time, it would be fine. Not too slammed, but that slow. So, this is just right. Just could have used a little more tips, though. winding down this night slowly but surely yeah but the tips are definitely not slowing down that's for sure i uh, just got a nine dollar and one cent tip putting my total tips now tonight at 68 
dollars and some change. Wow. <laughs> I love these kind of nights, man. It's been like that. Like I said, for the past few weeks, it's been like that. It's been crazy. I've actually been seeing $100 nights, you know. Usually it's not a regular thing for me, but hey, I'll take it. We only got uh, 58 more minutes, though. I would have said an hour, but I'm technical like that. But, uh, yeah, only 58 more minutes to go before we close and then clean up and go home. So, still got a little more time to make some more money tonight <sighs> and uh, keep on building up that total. I'm probably looking at an $80 to $90 a night guarantee right now. So, whoo, it's crazy. Open it continues on. I still got one more day this week uh, to work, which is Sunday, and I'm gonna be doing once again another grub up and Domino's day. So hopefully we can add to that total that we made today. <laughs> Anyways, let's finish up this night and uh, make some money. Like that, we're done for the night. It's been a long one, but I'm glad it's finally over. I need to get me a bite to eat now. I'm gonna stop in by Sheets and get me something, and then we'll do the calculations to see how I turned out tonight. For some of it, I already know, so <sighs> we'll see on the rest. <laughs> But it has definitely been a good night. And I'm ready for some sleep and some food. Maybe a little bit of writing, too. We'll see. All right, finally back home and ready to relax. But we got to go over exactly what I did today here on this day of a life of a delivery driver to see how much money it's possible to make. Now, mind you, the calculations that I have done does not include taxes only because um, each method has its own way I do my taxes with. Uh, and I'll explain that um, as we can do, go through the figures. But for that matter, um, well, let's see the figures, shall we? All right, right now... Down the left side of your screen, you see all the deliveries I made with Grubhub, with one of them having that $2 cash tip on the side. And total, I made eight deliveries today with Grubhub for a total of $69.78. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Taxes on that wise, I usually take out 25%. Um, and I'm not going to go into specifics on exactly on that particular amount right now. 
but that just gives you an idea. I usually take 25%, but I usually wait until I have a whole week's worth of grub hubbing before I do that. So um, the amount for it will obviously change the more I put into it um, at the end of the week. But I do it um, every time I get paid on Thursday from that particular venue. As for right there in the middle, uh, you will see that uh, all 25 of my deliveries and what I made on tips. Now, mind you, just tips alone. But I uh, had a few, obviously, zeros in that um, particular category. And I, but I did also have that $10 tip, which definitely was a big help. So my grand total from 25 deliveries just on tips, $68.11. Now, tax on that wise, um, I don't exactly always report all of my tips, so only a small percentage of that will actually have 25% off, and that, that'll be done uh, by Domino's itself, because any credit card tips sort of automatically get reported, so those definitely have um, the 25 or whatever they take out of percentage wise for uh, their taxes for state and federal. And uh, on the far right, well, you can see on the first number is the amount, of course, I made a uh, grand total for my, um, what I made on Grubhub for the whole day. And then the second number below that, of course, is all the tips I made. And uh, the third number is um, the hourly, the hourly wait, wait, <laughs> the hourly can't say it the hourly rate that I make while actually working at Domino's which I make eight dollars an hour I did about eight hours so roughly around sixty four dollars in wages now obviously there will be taxes taken out of that and of course that's every two weeks um, when that amount gets taken out when I get my check uh, below that is the amount of mileage I get paid. I get paid a certain amount of mileage for uh, every mile I go. I'm not 100% certain on what the per mile rate is. It's uh, anywhere between 29 and 32 cents a mile. Um, uh, but for that, uh, that day, I found out that my mileage total was $25.97. So my grand total for the day in this, li uh, in this daily uh, in this day of a life, I should say, of a delivery driver, I made the amount of $227.86, give or take, depending on the exact amount. Because I didn't get an exact amount of the time I worked there, so the hourly rate, it may be off a little bit. And it also does not include the taxes taken out. But that's not bad. $227. So... Definitely not a bad day. But there you have it. <sighs> That's what it's like to work as a delivery driver for both Grubhub and Domino's. You can make some serious money. And uh, definitely can make a living off of it. Uh, a lot better than what I have done in the past. So, always good for that. So, anyways, thank you for joining me on this day. And um, I'll catch you on the next one. <laughs> Alright? This is Crimson, signing off. Good night.